In Health Watch this noon, a woman in Arizona is getting her life back on track thanks to a unique treatment for epilepsy. Here's Ellen McNamara. They were pretty dangerous because they would come on any point, any time. Before she became a wife and mom of three, Nicole Phillips was diagnosed with epilepsy when she was 14. With medication, her seizures were controlled and she lived a normal life. But eventually, they came back. I wasn't able to drive and I wasn't able to really do anything. I don't I think that's more because of how sick I was. I was always just laying down and I'm very fortunate that I had a lot of support from my family. Nicole was sent to Mayo Clinic, Arizona, where Dr. Jonathan Parker is a neurosurgeon. She had seizures that were no longer responsive to medication. And when that happens, we really have to look at surgical options to try to control these seizures. Dr. Parker says brain surgery was the best option for Nicole. A resection removes the abnormal brain tissue that is causing the seizures. For Nicole, we had to be very, very careful because this abnormality on her imaging was right next to the motor center the brain, the strength center. I was just scared because they're actually going in and taking part of my brain out. And though we knew they were going to be taking the part of the brain out that was causing the seizures, we also didn't know what was around it. With cutting edge technology to map the brain, surgeons like Dr. Parker and a large team at Mayo Clinic, the 29 year old is now seizure free. This scan shows the portion of Nicole's brain that was removed. I'm back to being a mom. All three kids are in multiple sports and I do all of that with them. I'm driving, I'm working. I actually just became a business owner of my wedding company, which is huge to think a year ago, I wasn't even able to be with my kids or leave my couch and now I'm doing everything with them and just I have my life back again. This Thanksgiving, she and her husband, JW, are thankful. Oh my goodness, what am I not thankful for? Um, my health, obviously, my kids, my family, my husband, just the surgery, everything, the list goes on.